61A, lecture number 27. Announcements. Homework 6 is due today. Lab 10 will be posted shortly and is due next Thursday. Homework 7 will be posted shortly and is due next Friday. There are now office hours on Friday, in case you want some help. And I'm sad to say that I will have to cancel the Q&A session today because I'm not available at the normal time. These Q&A sessions normally run at 7.30 p.m. on Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I will continue them again next week, so if you have questions about today's lecture, just save them up for next Monday and I'll answer them then. The Q&A sessions are held via Google Hangouts or Zoom, and students ask questions about lecture material, and then I post those videos at the end of the video lecture series once that Q&A session has happened. And so far, it seems like people watch those, which is cool. So I plan to keep doing them for the rest of the semester, except for today. Today's lecture is an important one because it's the first step toward project four, which is about building your own interpreter. How can you use the scheme language if you only have a Python interpreter installed on your computer? Well, the answer is to write a Python program that interprets scheme. So we'll spend today's lecture and Monday's lecture looking at the structure of an interpreter, and then you can start building one yourself in project four.